Welcome back friends. Today I'm very excited because it's Tour Review Tuesday. Roll the intro. All right, welcome back friends to Tour Review Tuesday. Today's category is gonna be outdoor power equipment. So as you can see right here, I have the Echo PAS280. That stands for Pro Attachment Series. So the Echo Attachment that I'm running is the Pro Paddle. It's 22 and a half inches wide. It has 12 rubber fins all the way around. Take a look at that. I do have some footage from a couple months ago, some close ups. I'm going to show how this works on commercial property and then my own property as well. I have a gravel driveway, and that's what really excites me about this is being able to clean stuff off the lawn, especially like right after the snow plowing season when uh, some of those stones, like I have uh, crushed limestone, when those pieces get plowed and pushed over into the lawn you can take this right here and kind of sweep those all the way back because the thing that really makes me nervous in the springtime when I'm doing my first mowing is that I'm going to hit some stones and sling them across the yard with the mower. So uh, my Turf Tiger, the blades are thanking me for having the stones cleaned up with this first. All right, so the warranty on this is uh, very similar to other Echo products. Five-year consumer warranty, two-year commercial. So in addition to the PAS 280, this also runs on the PAS 266 and the 2620. So this is made to be used on lawns, grass, asphalt, concrete, driveways, whatever. It won't harm your lawn, but it will pick up like pine cones and walnuts and rocks, all types of different things. So I have over here, I have a couple white pines, my basketball hoop. Underneath there, I've really never cleaned those out. So the other day I was biking down the road, I have a neighbor, and I was checking out this pine tree, very similar, that's right near the road, and underneath it's just nice and clean, no pine cones or anything. So that inspires me to clean this up. So, so what I'm gonna do today is a few minutes of clean with the Pro Attachment Series, just to show you what you can do, the type of damage in a couple minutes of time. So I really think I can get that cleaned up pretty quick. But. So I've owned this Pro Paddle here since the spring, so it's kind of after the snow melted, but I have seen some people comment in the reviews on this, which all the reviews are awesome. Like go to the Home Depot website and check out the Pro Paddle there. Go to the Echo website and you'll see a lot of people have reviewed this and commented, asking questions. This is a big deal right here. So. A lot of people have talked about how well it works with snow. I've seen a lot of people reviewing it, showing it pushing snow. It's like a power broom. So I'm excited this winter you'll see me reviewing that as well. But by the time I picked this up this year, it was after all the snow melted. So I have some rather dead grass here. So it may pull some of that up because we haven't had rain here in like three weeks, I think. But I'm hoping that I can just take all these pine cones underneath both trees, put it in one pile, and then I will... Um, I'll rake it into like the wheelbarrow so I can haul it away somewhere. Whenever I'm outside working with outdoor power equipment, I do recommend hearing protection and eye protection. Safety first. All right, as you can see right here, I have all these pine cones that's everywhere. It's very thick and dense right underneath there. In the grass area right here, that should move pretty well. That's probably gonna require a little more heavy duty cleaning closer to the tree because that has never been raked out before. All right, let's start the engine.
So I probably just ran it for like three or four minutes. Check out <laughs> this huge pile right here. I don't know if you can see that. That is really thick. Actually, we have some tennis balls lost way deep down in there. Never been raked out before in probably 20 years. There's my pile right there. So I'm getting ready to haul that away. So the next thing I'm gonna do is actually push it downhill. It doesn't really make sense to push it uphill. But as you can see, it cleaned that whole mess right there going uphill. Amazing. And then for pine needles, you can see that mess right there. I turned it upside down. The pedals will spin reverse. So then you can pull it back towards you. And as you can see, just two or three pulls, I have that big mess of pine needles right there. The thing that I really like is that it moves a whole lot all at once. So imagine like how much you're saving your back versus having to do that all by hand, which would take a very long time. In the winter time here in Michigan, we get quite a bit of snow. So you can see with this long gravel driveway that I have, it uh, the stone can easily go off to the side and along this hill right here. So it's nice to have something that will kick the stone and put it back here. So I'm sure next spring, that pro paddle is gonna come in handy. Last year we didn't get a lot of snow. So I know Michigan this year, write it down, we're gonna get a lot of snow. I'm gonna to go to some commercial property after this and test it out there. And I'll show you how it works along the curbs. All right, so the one thing that I did when I'm running the edger, I have that handle up a little closer to me, closer to the trigger up there. So I noticed I needed to push this down further to help support the weight, make that balance a little bit better. I haven't, I'm not sure if I've hit that sweet spot yet, but right there is so far where it seems to be working pretty well for me. So I hope you enjoyed the video review of the Echo Pro Paddle along with the PS280. If there's another test that you'd like to see this done on, let me know. Reach out to me, maybe I'll make an Instagram story and try it under different circumstances. So if you find this video helpful and informative, please give it a thumbs up and help support my channel. That's it friends, thanks for watching. See you next time. If you like this video, I think you might like a few other videos over there to the right. So please click on those. And if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, hit that button down below. And if you would like to connect with me throughout the week, please check me out on Twitter and Instagram. All right friends. Enjoy.